Hey guys and welcome back to another episode of Lunar Mist. So today I wanted to go ahead and work on more witchery like I said in the last episode. So today I'm going to be focusing mainly on making the enchanted broom and let me tell you, there is so much you have to do to make an enchanted broom. I did not know that you have to do as much as you have to. Like, I am actually a bit anxious to even start it because there's so many things to do. But uh, I'm going to try and do it anyways today. Also, before I forget, I want to go ahead and hide this little guy here so that you guys can go ahead and hunt through, hunt for it throughout the episode. So let me go ahead and put him away, and I uh, will be back with you guys so we can continue some other things before we get started. So let me go ahead and do that. All right, guys, so I went ahead and hid our little guy. I feel like we should have a name for him. Maybe give me some suggestions in the comments below for names for the little guy that we're going to be hiding around, the duck. So, uh, yeah, give me some names just in the comments, and then I'll try and figure out what a name for this guy so we can have a name instead of, you know, just calling it the duck. Anyway, so I wanted to go ahead and choose two people today for the mannequin of the day. Um, I don't have a potato of the week for this week, but I'll try to get myself to get one for next week, or I, I promise to. I hope I can get a couple people going up on that wall. Um, but today we have Infinity Gaming and Maddie plays MC. So let me go ahead and go ahead and do that. I don't have the comments because I forgot to completely prepare myself for that. So uh, I apologize about that, guys. But um, um, they have been commenting a lot on my videos, and yeah. So, so after I finished recording the last episode, I went ahead and got straight back into decorating. Um, the outside, because as you guys know, I was working on the barn. So that is. Oh, uh, okay, that's awkward. Why did it let me back teleport back through? So, I'll show you guys that in one second, but I've done a lot of decorating there. So, let's go ahead and do this. Bam. Oh, okay, okay, you're a rainbow tiger. I miss my tiger skin, not gonna lie. I still love that. Let's give you that, and then... For you, let's give you... Oh my god, you guys are like twins! You guys are matching like rainbow? Oh, that's so cool. Okay. Uh, let's put your head up just a little bit, I think. There we go. Alright. So you guys go. Another addition to... Or two, another, two other additions to, to the family here. Um, so, basically, if I can continue in this direction, we have my barn and garden and everything. So, on this little path. I decided to kind of go ahead and put these lanterns on because um, the fairy lights mod has a bunch of like different themed like lights you can do. So I decided to pick like these kind of like, uh, I don't know, lantern style. I don't know if you would consider them Chinese lanterns or whatever they could be called, but I decided to go ahead and do that. Uh, I thought they looked cool, so I think it looks nice. I don't know. It's just like a different addition. It kind of just puts things together. The only thing I wish is like gave off more light because it is still pretty dark down here, so I might add some torches actually. Let's go ahead and do that now. Um, but yeah, so I just want to keep it bright so that we don't have a bunch of mobs spawning because that's not fun, especially when they're blowing up. But I think I should put torches here as well because it is kind of dark over here and I don't want my stuff to be like blowing up all the time you know um but anyways beyond that i decided to go ahead and make a path over here which is kind of cool it kind of took me a while to like get this path like in a certain position because it just looked weird but i think it looks kind of nice not gonna lie um i kind of like the whole style of this in a way i mean i could have changed it a bit but it is it works, it works. So, uh, basically, as you guys can see, the whole idea of this was to have uh, the gardens, like, surround that path in a way. Um, so that's what I have going on, and I really like it. It obviously will look a lot better when there's, like, plants actually growing. Uh, but I think I need to go ahead and try and figure out how to make the other crops, or try and get them somehow. I'm really not 100% familiar with the Magical Crops mod, which I want to get to know a bit more, because I think it's a really cool mod. Because uh, you get a lot of different foods and stuff. So if I go into here, because last time when I planted things, um, I got some grapes, blueberry, sweet corn, tomatoes, chili. And then these, I'm not 100% sure what you do with essence. I think that's what you do, what you use to make the obsidian, I think. I don't, I'm not totally sure with that, but uh, yeah. And then over here we, oh, the wrong side. <laughs> and then over here we have just like the normal crops growing, wheat, potatoes, and carrots. So that's basically it there. Um, I just said, oh my god, please, no, no, no. 
Oh my god, no, I don't want creepers around here right now. But uh, I think it looked, it looks, it's looking pretty cool. I like that. Um, I kind of like these kind of like little building projects because it just like, I don't know, it makes me, I don't know, I just, it makes everything look more put together in a way. Uh, because like ever since I added like this little like pathway around here, it kind of really just, it makes me, it doesn't look as plain and I really like the whole like decorating thing going on here. So uh, yeah, anyway, let's go back downstairs and start working on our broomstick because dang do we have a lot to get done with that one so i don't know where my broomstick actually is it might be in my witchery chest i think um let's see okay it is in here all right so we need that guy but we definitely i hope i have enough ingredients for everything else oh yeah so if you guys remember a while a few episodes back um i think i opened up the illuminati pet and i got an infinity egg which supposedly you can put onto your uh altar and it'll make the altar gain more power so let's see what okay all right i'm i'm fine with that so you need three thousand power um to be able to make the broomstick i think so yeah um i don't think we're gonna be needing anything else to like craft it because we're already over three thousand so i think we're pretty much uh good and set on that so the first thing we need to do so we already have the kettle built and now the next step is to do the flying ointment in order for us to make flying ointment we need we need redstone soup long duration potion of swiftness diamond feather Wool of Bat and Belladonna, 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 I think that's what it is. Um, so in order for us to make redstone soup, we need a redstone. Okay, so we need, okay, I don't have redstone in here, but we need the Tongue of Dog, uh, Wool of Bat, okay. Um, we need one Mandrake, a Belladonna flower, Belladonna, I don't know how to say it. So I think what we need to craft is the uh, drop of luck. Do we have any drop of luck? No, we don't. Okay. So we're going to need drop of luck and redstone. So I'm go ahead and grab one redstone first. So we have that prepared. And then uh, let's hopefully be on our way with that. Do I not have redstone? Oh, I think I have it left it outside when I was working on the outside here with the redstone lamps. I, th I think I have some down here. Please, 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 please. Yeah, I do. Okay. So just take some redstone with us and go back up okay so we have our redstone here so we have one redstone and then we need to make our drop of luck which you need refined evil and to get refined evil you need diamond vapor and a gas tier now i don't know if i have a gas tier so i might actually have to go into the into the nether and hunt for some ghasts which I really don't want to do. I don't even have a gas tier. Okay, so that's something I'm going to have to go into hunting for. Um, as far as diamond vapor, diamond vapor, you need a diamond and an oil of vit vitriol. Okay, quick lime is the easiest to make. So you need, scratch it by placing wood ash into a crafting grid um, in a much same. Okay, so let's go ahead and do that one first because that's like the easiest step to like the first thing we need to do. A step closer, I should say. Just a step closer. So let's go ahead and do that. Place it in here. Get our quick lime. So we have that set. Random chance when burning food item logs or jungle saplings. Oh, so it's not letting me. Okay, so I need to get saplings then. All right, I didn't think that. Do I have any food that I can cook? I might have food that I can cook. Let's see. Um. The potatoes. Oh, I put some potatoes I can cook. Okay, I have more than just some. Okay, let's hopefully be able to get that through this. Okay, so we have, we're hoping to get a full fume. So then we'll be able to craft the... Um, oh my god, that I didn't even realize how much of a process that is. Alright, so we got one. We have a full fume. So I'm not going to continue doing this because I don't know how much of that I actually need. So... We now have the full fume, and now I think what we do, um, we put those, we put that into a distillery with an empty clay jar. So, which one's the distillery? Kettle, cauldron, distillery. Okay, 
So we put this in here and then put that there and then that there. Okay. No. That's what it looks, that's what it says. In a distillery. I did what you said. I don't understand what I need to do still. Okay, I think I discovered what the issue is, is apparently I need this guy near my altar. So let's go ahead and place this guy down here. And uh, hopefully it'll work, please. No? Oh, there we go, okay, okay, all right. Now it's working, there we go. Oh, I was about to stress out and like end the episode there and like hopefully somebody would help me, but Google is a beautiful thing, guys. All right, so we have our oil of vitriol, 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 I think it's vitriol. Okay, so, and then we have some gypsum and then we got a slime ball, so that's kind of cool to know that you get that out of that. Um, so now we need a diamond. Let's go get ourselves a diamond going. Um, and hopefully we got this, guys. I really want to just make this because it's a challenge and I want to get through it, guys. Just get through it. Okay. So what, now we need to, in the distil distillery, we need to put the diamond and the oil of vitriol that we just made. So let's go ahead and do that. Put the diamond here. Oh, I forgot a clay jar. Give me a second. Um, do I need three? Because it says there's three in the picture, so I'm just gonna do what the picture says. Hopefully that works. Uh, all right, so let's go ahead and dump these in there. Put that here and do this. So that should be doing its thing. All right. Um, and then, so what we still need is a gas here just to get the refined evil. So I'm probably gonna go. After we get this guy, we're gonna, probably gonna go ahead and head into the nether and hunt for gas. Now we have our odor of purity. We have, we, oh, we got two diamond vapors. So that's awesome. So we need just the gas deer. Okay, cool, cool. All right, okay, this is, okay, I thought, it's not as hard as I thought. Maybe it'll get harder, but for now it is okay. So we don't need the order, oh, odor of purity. We only need one of these. So now time to head into the nether to get a gas tier and uh, yeah, let's hopefully get one. I just want one and that's all. I don't wanna have to hunt for ghasts forever. So uh, here we go. <gasps> yes, she dropped the gas tier. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Let me just die. Dude, oh my God, finally. <sighs> that took so long. I don't know how many ghasts I killed, but I took so many. <sighs> freaking finally i literally did have 12 okay i must have killed like 12 ghasts because <sighs> mm, never again ever 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 jesus that took forever okay now we gotta go into the distillery and uh let's go get some more clay jars thank god i have a bunch in here oh geez that took forever and i'm like really hungry right now so I'm probably gonna take a break and go uh eat something and then come back and finish recording because uh, okay, so I'm gonna have that this dude's thing and uh, I'll be back probably Well for you guys, it'll be like a second for me. It'll probably be like a 10 20 minutes So uh, yeah, I'll see you guys a little bit later. Actually. I'll wait until this distills. All right, so now we have our Full fume which we already had and then we have our odor of purity and we have our refined evil which is the main thing that we needed so let's go ahead and drop that there. We don't need that. So now that now that we have that, what else do we need? We need uh, Mutandus Extremis, which is, oh, that's easy to make. Okay, you just need Mutandus. Wait, but actually do I not, I don't have, okay, I'm just gonna go take a break and I'll be back. <laughs> I'll be back. All right guys, so I am now back, and uh, so now what we're gonna be doing is making some mutandus. So I forgot that mutandus isn't as hard to make as I thought. I just know that eggs was my my issue like every single time, and I still have yet to make a chicken farm. Um, but uh, egg, no, that's not what I meant to do. Uh, I wonder if I have any in my backpack. Or we could probably go, oh, I have one egg. Oh, maybe if I do egg. 
So we have one egg here. Let me go ahead and throw this stuff in here because I don't really need that right now. All right, so we have one egg here. I'm probably gonna go fly over to my uh, chicken farm and I'll try and get, try and see if I can get some over there. Um, so I don't have a water bucket in here actually. Probably should have one on hand. All right, so let's go ahead and get ourselves some water into our uh, that thing, whatever this is called, cauldron. All right, and now what we need is some mandrake, uh, exhaled of the horned one, and uh, an egg. So it goes this guy, then it goes that guy, and that guy. So we need one more egg. If we could get one more, then we'd be all set to do this. Should get some mutandas. Oh, we get six. Why does it say on the website that you only get four? So I need to, but I still need to make some more. So I'm gonna go ahead and fly over to my chicken peeps, my farm. I believe that they're still here. They should be. Yep. But no eggs? Guys, what have you been doing this whole time? Not even one? <sighs> you lazy butts. Do I have any seeds in here? Nope. I'm just gonna hold this chicken. And hopefully it gives me an egg. Oh, the chicken gave me an egg! It ju I just watched it plop into my inventory. Okay. Did these guys didn't drop any eggs though? Of course not why would you anyway now we have our egg so I need to remember to keep that chicken pet in my inventory for a little bit and uh, it'll just give me eggs cuz that's what it does it gives you eggs guys so let's go ahead and head back down if I can oh this chicken egg is this chicken is throwing me off right now all right this way um so we need <coughs> to get ourselves water back in here All right, so we need, where'd the egg go? Where'd the egg go? What? What? Oh my God, what did I do with that egg? Is this a joke? What? Oh my god. Did I drop it? Or am I just not seeing it? No, there's definitely not an egg in here. What the heck? I swear I'm not going crazy. There was an egg in here. What the heck, man? Oh my god, it gave me an egg! Okay. There's an egg in here. 100% in there. Watch, I'm gonna, if it disappears, I sort of, oh, I didn't mean to do that. No more undos, what the heck does that mean? What? I swear I've had that happen to me before I pressed the wrong button. Please tell me it's still in my inventory. Okay, it is. All right. All right, now let's go back in here. Take this egg, put it in here. So, we go boom, bam, pow. And we should get our mutandas. All right, sweet. Okay, so I do one and two. Why isn't that happening? What the heck? What now? What is this? Witchery brew name. Uh, I don't want that. Okay, so I feel like what I'm gonna have to do is like move everything down here because apparently everything needs so much altar power. So like, man, uh, I might just end up having to like make a separate thing. Mm, would I spend so much time? I don't know. I'll have to think about that later. But I'm gonna have to go ahead and move uh, that stuff down. Okay, I don't know what's going on with that, but you know, whatever. Oh no, this is not, no. JK, nothing else is setting a light? Okay. I don't know if we'll be able to make the whole freaking uh, enchanted broom in this episode because I feel like it's already taken a while. So we'll just see where we go 
and or how far we get into this and then maybe we'll continue it in the next episode but uh yeah all right so what we need is to do this so let's go ahead and drop our stuff okay so now it's actually doing something so that means i guess that's not close enough which sucks because how much power i mean i feel like it should give off what what oh my god no oh my god oh my god no no oh my gosh no 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 stop no you're burning everything please no oh my gosh my house no please oh my god why is this happening to me why why no no, please. No! Oh my god. I don't understand why that happened. Maybe it is a really bad idea to have this in my house. Like, a really bad idea. Oh my god. No, it burned down my trees. Oh my god, please stop. Please stop burning. Please. 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 Are you kidding? Oh my god. I think... <sighs> this has gone all wrong. Way too fast. What the heck? I think I'm gonna, um... Go ahead and, uh... <laughs> Well, not well. I was gonna sneeze too, but I think I'm gonna go ahead and um end this off here. I'm really like, what? I didn't know there was a chance of getting paralyzed. What? I don't understand. If somebody can explain to me, I just maybe you don't. You don't even have to explain to me because I just witnessed it myself. I don't. All right. Well, um. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, end this episode off here, guys. I'm sorry. I just, I'm a bit frustrated right now, I think. So, uh, I don't want to continue on and get frustrated anymore. <laughs> I'm really sorry, guys. But uh, I think I'm gonna go ahead and this, end this off right here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this, uh, I guess, fail of an episode. Ah, oh, dang. I'll talk to you guys in another video. <laughs> Bye, guys. Dang it.